<laughs> Bowser, relentless! It seems he's trying to challenge you to a final battle, Waluigi. Will you settle this with Bowser? Yes, we will. Good luck, Waluigi. Protect everyone's dream. This is the final, ladies and gentlemen. This is the final board for story mode. And for the last time, Toad will be helping us. Although we didn't need his assistant for the last two streams, I believe. If I remember correctly. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the final board. This is Bowser Nightmare. This is the only unlockable board in the game. Here we are. This is my dream. This looks horribly good, Bowser. It's Waluigi. Don't you... Why don't you just get out of here? Yeah, what he said. I'm warning you. Get out of here. You really are a pest. Sorry, but you got to go. Koopa Kid, go to it. I also love the cutscene that happened right here, because this one is really different. Let's see it! Red Koopa Kid! Blue Koopa Kid! Hello, I'm the handsome one! <laughs> it's the green Koopa Kid! Wahaha! <laughs> that was unexpected! Wahaha! But my underneath are tough! Wahaha! Yeah, I think I heard that one before. Red, green, and blue. Cooper Kid, take care of this pet. Wah! All right, this is the final board of the game. And the main board for party mode is pretty big for the most part. What I will, what I will say for uh, this. This, um, this board, this one can be pretty chaotic. Now, would I say this is the best board? No, not really. But what we want to avoid is this. Hitting that will take half of your coin. Which, in this case, we ain't gonna lose 10 and... Red, I think, is gonna lose 11. Yeah, he does. Alright. The more coins I the more coins I get, the happier I am. And, wow, that's a... A lot of stuff just happened just then. Yeah, I want to say out of all the boards that we have played so far, this one is by far the toughest board. And it's mainly due because of the the Bowser space, the happening space where the green Koopa just landed on earlier. Okay, okay, so so the blue Koopa Kid missed me. The green one also missed me, but the red did not, despite having the mushroom in his possession. Next match is going to be a repeat of Butt Masher. Jeez, how many times do we have to play this minigame? I don't even like this minigame at all, generally. Seriously, I always get nervous when I play these sort of minigames. Nope. Oh boy. Oh boy. Blech. No! Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The the, that went totally unexpected. I was expecting the L button to appear. And if, if the L button appeared, that would have really, well, sort of shot down my plan. Shamefully not the case, though. But let's see where Red ends up landing. He's inside the danger zone again. Where he just lost his coin just recently. Yeah. 
Okay, what is up with all these low rolls? This is two, three times I rolled low. Jeez. Okay, what did I land on? Oh, hey! Oh, hello! Uh, uh, I hate a block base? I'll gladly take that. I'll gladly take that. Uh... The Red Koopa Kid is throwing a curved mushroom. Anyone else throwing item? He's also throwing an item. The green one. And for the blue one, he's not using his. And I'm getting challenged, looks like. And it's the green one this time. I'm in the lead for coin, but that could change quickly. Uh, here we go again! Uh, seriously, how many times do we have to play, like, some luck-based minigame? I think out of all the Koopa Kids that we fought, Green is where I had to fight against had the most in terms of luck-based. Uh Oh no. Please tell me I predicted right! Yes! Yes! Yes I did! Finish! Noise! Yeah! Waluigi the winner! I had a feeling that was probably gonna be on a two or something. Do win on head waiter? Play it safe. Or go big. Whatever you choose. I guess. <laughs> uh... Hey, he missed! <laughs> he missed! He missed! Yay! The, the green Koopa Kid missed! He missed! He missed! <laughs> no, he misses! Uh. Uh, Alright, Green. I fought you again. I fought you once. I'm fighting you again. What's the minigame? Bound of Music! Ah, uh, oh, this is a pretty good one. I like this one good. Jump around the clouds and try to find as many invisible blocks with a musical note on them as you can. Move with control, take an A to jump. Regular block won't help you win. Keep jumping and looking for block with musical notes on them. Now this one, if you have good vision of where all those blocks are, then this can be easy. But if you don't, well, Best luck to you! Just saying. Uh, uh, I'm pretty sure I got that minigame in the bag. I didn't see green get much. Green Koopa Kid got five. I got... I think I counted either ten or nine. It was... It's somewhere around there. But regardless, we crushed him. Just one more victory, and, and... And he's gone. Uh, did I catch the, the red one? Yes, I did. Uh, what are my options? A red or a blue? I want to take out the red. I'm going to take out the red, because... He's looking pretty juicy right now. Not very juicy when it comes to luck, babe. I was hoping for Mary Popping right there. Uh, we're playing so many luck based minigame on story mode. Uh I I'm I'm not even surprised anymore. And Ha <laughs> ha! First try! 
Yes! First try win! Wow, that was unexpected! Why make it on the first try? I never th thought that could happen! <laughs> Alright, write it down with green and blue remaining! Fortunately, I'm gonna get a red here, but whatever. Just whatever. Up, oh, up, oh, green's out. Green's out. Green is out. One red face. The red face killed him. Killed by the red face. But unfortunately, the only one that's staying in the way now is the blue one, who is looking really good on on coin. That's pretty worrisome. Uh, thankfully did not hit the happening space. I think I hit something... I think I hit something bad. I forgot. I don't know what I landed on. Uh, anyway. Well, it looks like we... Anyway, we got a lot of work to do on the blue Koopa Kid. And I mean a lot of work. Let's see what happens. I'm pretty good with these Sky Survivor game. Unlike the Koopa Kids. And I'm sorry, what? I I I hit one already? Oh, blue Koopa Kid Blue Koopa Kid, you dirty freaking player. I see what you're trying to freaking do. You're trying to mess up my freaking vision. Oh no. Uh, tied! And it's a tie! Tie game! Draw. Tie game! That's our that's our first draw! I'm surprised we actually made it to the end, honestly. Well, that was pretty pointless. At least I didn't get KO'd, though. Or else that would have been really bad for me. And I mean bad. Blue is throwing an orb. Throwing the hidden. I get the roll double next turn. Apparently he's also going to get a mushroom after after this. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a big showdown between me and Koopa Kid at this rate. It's either I'm taking him down or he's taking me down. Good news is that our next match can't be a draw. Destroyed the blue Koopa Kid just like last time. Uh, if only if I was the pursuer right there and not he. Uh. Twenty twenty six coins remaining off of the blue. Let's see what happens here. I'm saying that like I'm I'm a broken record. What is wrong with me? <laughs> uh I'm gonna throw my my thing over here. I'm gonna throw mine here. Anyway, let's go! Let's roll high! Or not! Or not! Uh my options. Oh versus! Oh versus mode! Perfect! Oh, perfect! Versus mode! That's exactly what I needed! This could still backfire, though, unfortunately. Depending on what minigame we got... Ah! Oh! Ah, oh, of course! 
Ah, freaking course. Of course it's a luck-based minigame. What else would it be? I hate these luck-based minigames. The one time I didn't want that. And the winner is me! The winner is me! I chose correctly! I have the upper crown! I have the advantage here! 59 versus his 9 coins! Another versus finish him off! Here at this rate! Who knows what the blue one's gonna do from here on out? Did it reach me with that roll? Did not reach me with that roll. Got a blue. Or red. Sorry, red. That is the opposite of what I wanted to say. And, hey, more hidden block! More hidden block! Hidden block! Found that again! Awesome! We are looking really good with coin right now. A and the blue Koopa Kid is going to lose half his coin from Donkey Kong because that's how the game works. Which means three coins are gone, which means another red face finishes him off. Long game so far. Long game. He has to win against me to survive. Otherwise, if he hit a, if he loses or get a red face, that's it. Oh no! Oh no! No! Ah, oh, that was, oh, that's not what I wanted to see. Uh, uh, my cut coins are gonna get cut down to 38. That was, that was, that was really bad timing for it to happen. Ah, uh, that sucks. At least I get another chance to catch him. Or we can continue to roll like crap. Apparently. Uh, gonna play it safe. I don't want to know what what's down there. Here we go. It's all or nothing now. One, one more, one more victory for me, and it's over. Otherwise, the game continues. Shock Absorber is the next one. And could be a potential last dual minigame. Avoid the amp, and don't let yourself get shocked by the electricity flowing between them! Whoever lasts the longest wins! And we just move. The amp fly around and ricochet off of each other and the wall, so stay alert! The, go the goal right here is to win one more time! If, if he wins, the game continues. Otherwise, it's over. This could go either way. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. No! No, damn it! I had a chance to win. Ah. Uh. I was trying to avoid the amp, and, 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 and the amp got me, unfortunately. Not all hope is lost, though. Okay, sorry about the silent there. I got interrupted again. Anyway. Well, didn't take out... Well, didn't take out, um... 
didn't take out Blue Koopa Kid on that last minigame, but hopefully we can on this next try. And get better luck. Which is more than likely. Which is more than likely to happen. Just gotta press fast enough. I've been doing pretty good with the butt mashing. Mm. Mm. Go! Go to victory! Yeah! Tied my record! All right, that's it. That is Bowser's Nightmare. That one took pretty long, don't you think? We may not want all the game, but we, we survived. And that's all that matters. And this is the final time for this game that will be seen, the Colored Koopa Kids. I beg your forgiveness. Don't worry, you did great. I don't get it. Bwahaha! <laughs> Looks like my dreams are coming true! Huh? That's right, Weakling! Yeah, Waluigi! Hey, Waluigi! This really is the last one! Let's go! Are you scared, Waluigi? Well then, we're waiting! Yeah! And that's it! We are done with all the dream board, and for our last one, we unsurprisingly got a B rank. And our final ranking is Great Star. Now, for ranking, I, I don't have any confirmation of what all the rankings are, but I don't think uh, Great Star is the highest one that you can get. I think there's high ranking, but someone confirmed that for me, just to let you know. To let me know, I'm sorry. Yeah. Anyway. We may be done with Battle Nightmare, but there's something else. Wahahaha! <laughs> Night nice work, Waluigi! But the last battle still awaits you. What will you do? We will continue. I also want to apologize again that I had to cut out some of the footage. It's just that I. I was interrupted for a reason. But anyway, we're gonna enter to the final battle. Good, good. I've been waiting for this, Waluigi. At last, the final battle is here. All right, here we go. Here we are at the final battle. ha <laughs> ha! Welcome to my most terrible stage of terror ever! First, let's see how you deal with these! Alright! So the mini game that we're playing is called Fright Man. This is where... We're gonna face a gauntless amount of ch challenge here. The first one we're doing is, uh... Fighting the Mecha Koopa. All you gotta do for this one is, you wanna jump on every single Mecha Koopa before time runs out. Basically. So the first phase isn't that hard. And you also got HP which you can see on the left side. Anyway. Is there more? Wahaha! If that wasn't hard enough for you, here, take this! So after one phase, we have another phase. This is the Ring of Fire. All we gotta do here is we got to survive within the time limit. That's all we gotta do. So, both most of these phases aren't that hard. But if you mess up like, but if you mess up like I did right there, then you're gonna be taking a lot of damage. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does get hard from uh, here on out. But yeah, but as you guys saw, I didn't do too well with the Ring of Fire, and I took three hits. Which means I have 7 HP left. Yeah, that's it. Let's see how you do against me. 
So after Too Faced, Bowser will come right down. I'll power you into the crumbling floor, you weakling. Alright, so the third fave is Bowser will start trying to attack you. There are a lot of variety of attack that he can do. Fourth of which are breathing fire. Uh, do He'll also do like a charge attack uh, as well and that stuff. Basically, all you gotta do is get him to ground pound on a certain panel. And that will cause that panel to break. So, yeah. Finish. All the ground pound tower takes up to three hit. And if you get trapped in one of them, then he'll eventually go down. And now for the final phase. Dread, you made it this far. I guess the only thing I got now is this. So long, run. Don't drink alcohol. It's bad for you. Oh wait! The drink made him make him make a sign. Huh? Run! What are you waiting for? I'm helpless. All right, here we go. This is the final phase, and this is where we have to take out Bowser once and for all. So. What he's gonna do first is he's gonna throw three orbs, and after three orbs, he will eventually breathe fire. And after that, what he'll do also is throw an electric orb, which will knock all the orbs off there, whether they're lit or not. Basically, what you gotta do here is you want to have Bowser breathe on the orb, and what he does, you gotta grab the orb. Dodge his electric attack and throw. And as he throw, and as he throws more orb, as the game progresses, he will start throwing. Uh, he will start throwing more orb. I think after three hits, he starts to throw four. But other, either way, I feel like this as well as the third and the and the. First part is pretty easy. And apparently I was wrong about what I said. I do think he can throw up the four orb. Or, or maybe throw like like yeah. So there's four orb. So yeah, he does throw up to like two to two through four orb. So yeah, that's basically all you gotta do. And with that. We have defeated Bowser once and for all. He has zero HP left. Oh, what's happening to Bowser? Oh boy. Looks like Bowser's blasting off again. Be sucked into like some kind of black hole. Yeah, Waluigi's the winner. Waluigi's number one. He is the best. He gets to defeat the Koopa Kids and Bowser. What? I lost! But with this, a dream has come true. As a gift, I'll tell you what my dream was. That is, I wished for a strong opponent. In other words, my dream has come true. I lost the battle, but I still won. I tend to think positively. Later, Waluigi, we'll meet again! Aw, that's sad. Also happy that Bowser's dream came true. Swims away in sadness. Somehow, my dream came true too. It must be because I was helping Waluigi. Your dream was to help Waluigi, wasn't it? Well, Toad, I'm glad it came true. Bye, Toad. Until we start doing party mode. Waluigi, thank you. I'm really grateful. You protected all the dream. Well, not all of them, because we we had Toy and Rainbow that we hadn't encountered. As said in the last part. Anyway, not everyone can dream again. The Dream Depot is once again safe. And I can 
marvel at all the dream, all the while wishing my dream comes true. And that is the end of the story mode. Pretty short story mode, if I have to say so myself. Now, would I say this is the best story mode? <laughs> Not even close, because to me, in my opinion, the story mode, it feels really short. There's a lot more to this game that I still have to cover, so... Normally, I would, uh... Say what my overall opinion is with the game, but I'm not gonna do it right here because it would feel wrong to leave out party mode and all the rest of the mode that we still have yet to cover. So anyway, yeah. Now while the story mode wasn't great and it was cut too short, I still had a a pretty decent time. My biggest complaint are the dual minigames on, on, uh, Mario Party 5. And I can especially say that for story mode, because it almost feels like more than half of the minigame, as I said, are luck-based ones. I mean, at least luck wasn't too bad on my side, but occasionally you do have bad luck, and I know that has happened to me before, like, in the past. Uh, when I played this game. But anyway, yeah. So anyway guys, I wanna... Anyway guys, I wanna thank you guys all so much for watching the story mode. And obviously next time we're gonna be doing party mode. Which I do have a set of rules for that I want to do. So, join back here next time and we start party mode. Now, which board are we going to start first? Well, I don't know. It all depends, really. So, yeah. So, once again, I am Fightman64, and this has been Mori Party 5 Story Mode. Join me back here next time for Party Mode. So, so until then, see you all. Have a good day. Game on, my friend, and take care. Goodbye, everybody, and stay safe. Adios!